very difficult day. So I came down here, uh, number one, to express my support to the community, uh, express my support to the families of those whose family members were, were shot and wounded or killed, uh, the residents of the community of Babcock Village, and of course the first responders. I just had a few minutes to talk to a number of the first responders. They are incredibly brave, and I want to say thank you to them on behalf of everyone in West LA and in Rhode Island. When they went into Babcock Village, it was an active shooter situation. They didn't know uh, what they were walking into. They put their lives at risk, and they walked in there. They stabilized the situation. And I want to say thank you to those brave men and women who responded. I also want to say um, to everybody, uh, in Westerly, especially the teachers and parents and students who are on lockdown, uh, thank you for your bravery and, and to all of you, let us know if you need help. This is a stressful time of year. This is an unbelievably stressful event that happened today. Uh, we are here for you. Uh, if you have mental health needs or needs for support, please reach out. The message is Rhode Island is with you. We are with you. We're here to help you. This. And I'd ask the people of Rhode Island and the people of Westerly, let's rally around this community. Let's do what good neighbors do and provide the support and comfort and love um, that people who are involved in this and in this community need.